I think I'm getting it. Earlier, you promised to tell me about the three fundamental variables of EVM. What are they? PV, EV, and AC. What? (laughs) Unfortunately, there are a few acronyms associated with EVM. I'll translate them into plain English for you. Let's start with PV, which stands for planned value. Plainly speaking, it is the plan. So just to be sure, PV is like the plan you made in the coast-to-coast example. You got it. We can graph the plan on two axes, the horizontal being time and the vertical being cost. The planned work, or PV line, starts at zero and goes all the way to the end of the project. Early after the contract award, planners decide which tasks will be completed in each month. All right, I'm getting a good grasp on PV. Tell me about the second EVM term. Okay. The dashed blue line is called EV, or earned value. This term measures progress. I see. So as the contract progresses, we assess progress against the plan. Precisely. The time is now 12 months since the project began. So how are we doing? It's evident we did not get as much done as planned. You're right. The EV is less than PV. This is why it's so important to have a good, realistic plan. If the plan is overambitious, then we'll always be behind. Dana, are you saying this plan was too ambitious? No, not exactly. It could be that the execution of the plan has run into issues. We'll need to ask good questions of the team responsible for the project. That leaves us with the green dashed line. Any guesses as to what it might represent? Actual cost? Yes, indeed. AC stands for actual cost. So Jim, how do you think we're doing budget-wise? In this scenario, it certainly appears they're spending more than work accomplished. That's not good. Indeed. Looks like it may be time for a course correction. The EV instrumentation is telling us they are off course. Yes, I get it. Plan the work and work the plan. As you work the plan, you make progress. As you make progress, you spend resources. If you accomplished less work than planned, meaning EV is less than PV, you're behind schedule. And if you spent more than you earned, meaning AC is greater than EV, you're overrunning the budget. Wow, you nailed it. Well, thanks, Dana. Thanks for making EVM basics so simple to understand. I think the light has finally come on. It's been my pleasure, Jim. You're a good student.